of you Twix and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another episode of Island Life. Um, <laughs> I am actually on the quest of still finding where the dock is and when I look at my map here I think this is the dock down here. I believe this is where they're talking about. So we're going to go ahead and mosey our way on down now it is night as you can see can i jump yes i can actually jump in here i just wanted to make sure i could and it looks like i have to go this way to get out but yeah so um we're going to go ahead and head south and hope for the best because we still haven't found the dock and it's kind of hindering our um progression because i have this one thing that i need to do and i can't get that one thing right uh, let me just make sure that I'm still heading. Okay. I feel like, okay, yeah, this is starting to make sense now. I, wow, this beach is kind of really littery. What the heck? Okay. So, um, excuse my voice. I just, oh, look at beach balls. So I made it, I think, right? Find the pier. Explore and find the pier. No, I just find the pier. So can I get up here? doesn't look like it um it's dark out and you keep seeing oh i'm also hungry so i probably better eat something um and am i tired because i thought i went to sleep no it says that i'm well rested so i don't think that i need to go to sleep but what is all this okay so this is actually boarded up so i'm going to assume that we will eventually have to come here and fix up the pier area, which is fine because it is super like littered and it's littered. Okay. There's no such thing as super littered. It is littered with junk and, and well, maybe not so much junk. This just looks like, okay. In the dark, it was kind of hard to tell. So it just looks like people left their shovels and stuff, but, um, definitely the chairs are all broken up. Some of them. Um, and of course there's some boarded up, uh, panels that on the, the building here. So, okay. So I need to gather material to, um, help with building the bridge. So I need 15 wood plate, 10 stone and four rope. And I'm not really sure how to get the rope. Um, but we're going to go ahead and start chopping down some trees. I I think I should probably chop down regular trees. Is there such thing as regular trees on this island? Yeah, okay. I was gonna say, like, I don't wanna chop down the pine trees, the uh, pine trees, the palm trees. So we will chop these down. I have to say that the, um, the chopping is really satisfying. Okay, I'm thirsty now. I don't have anything to drink. Um, oh wait, I have five water here. So can I just put, oh yeah, I can do that. Plop it right here. Get me something to drink. Oh wait, are these empty? These are empty. Oh shoot, how do I get water? Um, I'm assuming that, I guess I get to turn my, my flashlight off. Okay, so. Um, hmm. Was there a body of water on my farm? I, oh gosh, those. Okay, I don't see anything, and I didn't recall seeing any fresh water. I keep running into those. Um, I need to watch where I'm going. Yeah, I didn't see like a body of fresh water anywhere. Oh, here's some. So, can I. How do I get water? Oh wow, she's flying. What is that? Is it a froggy? It's a froggy. So we can't go in the water. And I can't fill up. How do I get water? <laughs> um, I'm very thirsty at this point. So I feel like I'm going to like probably faint of thirst. Let me eat something. Nope, I can't. That didn't help any. It did a little bit. No, it didn't. Yeah, okay, so, all right, let's look at this really quick. Um, hmm, so that's not, one. so this will actually help us, because this says drink, so this is 
fine. This is a coconut. So the coconut... Okay, so it did work. Um, and I'm hungry again. What? I am forever hungry. So let me shake some trees. And make sure that I get some foodables and some drinkables. Okay, there's nothing there right now. So let's just get back to um, hammering down these. What the? Oh. Hmm. Maybe we have to leave our land to do this? Maybe not. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that just feels really satisfying and it's quick. You know? See that? It, it just feels... I don't know. You know how some farming games, it feels like it's like tedious? But this doesn't really feel tedious. Um, but I'm assuming that we will have to upgrade our tools um, as the game progresses. So we won't have to use so much energy to... Um, how much wood do I need? I said I needed 15 wood plate. I have 64 logs and I also need stone and rope. I am not even sure where I would even get rope. Let's see if this is it. Okay, so plant fiber. I kind of thought so. So yeah, let's get gather a little bit more plant fiber and And then we need I need to keep my catch my breath. Okay. So, she's tired. Oh, okay, her energy. Oh, she's sleeping? It's so early. Oh, no. It's raining. It's raining. Okay, we're just going to use our workshop anyway. Uh, make some wood plates. We need 15 wood plate. Okay, I want to let me make even numbers. Okay, fine. No problem. So, this is going to take a while. Can I make another workbench? Now, what is this? Um, I guess we can. Can I? So hammering. Furnace. Workstation. So. Interesting. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Oh, a power generator. Okay, so power will be used at some point. Um, we're going to try to get some of these, uh, thorns down. Let me see if I can... Ugh. Besides, this is a good resource. wonder why fat comes off of the thorns. So weird. It's so weird. Okay, let me eat this coconut. Um... And I will try to chop... Oh, wait. Wait. Okay. Okay. That did start me a little bit. <laughs> um. Oh. That is so odd. I want to see what this is coming off these thorns. What is this? Okay, so we've got fat. Fat is an essential item to make any fuel-based machines or generators to run. You can get from spiky plants or some creatures. That's so odd. And then, of course, we got some crab meat or crab claws, crab legs. We got a watering can. Uh, we do have food. Let's put this here. Um, actually, what I want to do is rearrange some things here. So let's put this here. Let's put this here. Three, four, and my machete, five. And let's put cherry six. Oops. What did I do? I think I replaced it. Let's put this in five. And... Put this here. Okay, so that'll do for now. I don't know. This is... Okay, so empty bottles can be used to store liquids like water and oil. Go to the nearest lake or water source to fill with water. But how do you do that? How do you do that? Anyways, we'll, we'll go ahead and hot key that one. And we'll figure that out. So let's go ahead and gather some more fiber. And... Okay, so we're done here with the... I'm already sleepy. It's probably because I got up super early, but let me, um... Oh, I don't want to get too close. Too late. Okay, wait, let me catch my breath. Fine, 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 fine. Enough. 
smell. Okay. So, all right. So we got that. And all we need is 10 stone. I don't have stone. But I will make the rope. Was it rope? Yeah. So I need four rope. We'll make that. And then I just need stone. And we can get stone from rocks, obviously. But what rocks? Let's forge this real quick. Um, trying to think like what rocks we can use. Uh, these are obviously too big. Maybe these smaller ones here. No. This is a treasure chest that we can't get. What about this one here? No. Um. Oh, wait. Maybe those um, piles in the yard. Let's see. I'm going to get back this way. I have yet to meet anybody. Um, but let's try this. Yep. So we got stone from here. And see how much stone we get. Awesome. Lot, that's a lot of stone. That is a lot of stone. And we have the rope. I need to rest. Not in the mood. Wow. Okay. Um, I can't even gather this. Okay, no problem. Um, she's very tired, so we're going to go ahead and go back to sleep. We're going to turn on our flashlight. Oh, it's still light on here because it's not nighttime. And I think I got up too early and I didn't sleep enough. So let's try to sleep for like seven hours and um, hopefully she'll be refreshed. Um, it'll probably be dark. Game save, wake up. It is dark a little bit. And is it still raining? It is still raining and it's nighttime. Um, she's still sleepy? She's hungry. Okay, so now we're good. We're good. So, the bridge. It was over here, right? Can I pinpoint it? Um, I don't know if there's any way to actually mark the map, but... It's up here somewhere, so we should be good. Um, let me see. He's probably not even here. Is this the right way? I feel like it is. It is. Okay. Yep, he's still working. So here's the stuff. Yes, I have all the materials. Awesome. Thank you. I'll be able to speed this up. Get some rest in your home. The next day will be ready i am sure okay cool so i don't even think that yeah i couldn't even get to town until we made the bridge so why don't we go ahead and get some more sleep and um she's thirsty so maybe i should do a little bit of forging first before i go to sleep um get some of those coconuts because i still haven't figured out the water situation um, but the coconuts seem to do just as well and I can't jump the fences. I guess it's a good thing. I wonder how much if um, how much of this land we can actually use and if there's other things that we can build on the land. What are these? These are the flowers. Um, okay, let's shake these coconut, these palm trees, coconut trees. She's already thirsty again. She is forever thirsty. I wonder if she gets thirstier if it's not exactly water, but coconut water is really refreshing. Um, is she still thirsty? Yep. Okay, she's not. Now she's hungry. She is forever hungry. Okay, so now she's less hungry. Let's do some more foraging, get some more apples. Um, and I assume like if you cook, if you cook items, items, if you cook food, um, they fill you up faster and for longer periods of time. That's what I'm assuming. Okay, so let's head back in. It's raining. It's dark. We have to wait for the bridge to be um, built before we can even get to town. And um, it looks like we have light in the house, sort of. I love the little particles here. I, I really do like the art style. It's very whimsical. Um... Okay, so let's let's sleep for like let's just sleep the seven hours. The bridge should be done by then. I think seven hours would be like a full night's rest. 
Okay, so she's fully rested, very hungry, and it's still storming. So we're gonna eat. We're gonna head out, get our axe, head over to the bridge. Let's do some foraging, get some more of these apples. So it looks like, okay, if it doesn't have an apple in it, I don't think it'll produce an apple when you uh, shake it, so. At least that's what it looks like. Uh, okay. Oh, the bridge is done. Sweet. So let's go to town. Um, this is a long bridge. This would make me nervous walking across. <laughs> Seriously. Okay, here we go. Are we in town now? What is this? Oh, lots of thorns. Jeez. Okay, who's who's here? Who's this? Is this somebody's spot? Can we chop their wood? Probably shouldn't do that. All right, let's get something to drink. Maybe we can purchase some items too in town. And what is this? Oh, somebody. Hello. Hey, hello. I don't remember you here before, but my memory is not as good as it was before. Nope, I'm new. What can this little old man do for you? Um, hmm. Uh, nothing really. I'm Pix. Just trying to get to know everyone here. I'm Pix. I don't need anything really. I was just passing through. My name is Pix. I was just passing through. Good to know you. I did not get your name. Sorry. Um, let's use that last choice. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm John. Great to meet you, Pix. As you can see, my head is slow nowadays. I know the feeling. I am how I could say someone that like to live a simple life i don't care too much about some stuff you can find me near my tent i like to go around the beach and see the ocean oh that was your tent that i just tried to wrap sorry remember if you have a spare coin sometime i am always here oh okay sure i mean we're in the same boat dude i'm trying to fix up a house that my parents just kind of told me to go to it's like set me off to i feel like it's a whole setup so now I'm hungry again and I can't get through. Okay, so honestly, this might be like the end of the road here. Although we've come. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, she's hungry. Of course. She eats a lot. A lot. Is she still hungry? Yeah, she's still hungry. My gosh. Okay, so I don't think I can get anywhere else, it looks like. Um, let me look at the map here. So this is the town. This is my property here. And this is where I'm trying to get and I can't get there. So I don't know if that's because this is the demo or what. But, um, you know, hey, if that's all there is, that's all there is. Let me just try it one more time. Um, sorry about hitting the mic. And maybe there's just another route. Let's see what's down here real quick. No, okay, so this is blocked off to you by a bunch of rocks. Okay, so it looks like that is the end. Can I go around? Nope. Okay, can't. Well, let's look at the sign. This is as far as you can go in the demo version. Thank you very much for playing our game. From this point in, and forward, you will find the town and all the citizens and will be able to get quests, explore caves, and visit some unique places. Okay. Everything will be available when we release the game. You can keep playing on your own island with the resources available at the demo. Please do not forget to report bugs or suggestions in our forums. Okay, so basically we've finished the game and that was like a really quick, um, that was really quick. So I probably could have done this all at once, but you know, here we are. Anyways, I guess I could just go ahead and tell you how I feel about the game so far. Right now, I think I in would enjoy this as a casual um, kind of play on my own time. Definitely as something that I would like record on the channel. But yes, again, very casual game that I would enjoy on my own. Um, I think the art style is really cute, super vibrant. I love the 3D setting. Um, you know, I don't always mind, uh, I, you know, pixelated is fine for these kind of games, but I do like the more, more realistic uh, look as well. Not that this is very realistic. This is still cartoony, but I still like the, like the clay look that they have going on. Um, and the controls are very, you know, simple. Um, it's, it seems like though, 
when you're walking along, it, it can be a little bit touchy and that might be something that you can adjust later. I don't know. Um, but it is simple, the WASD. And it honestly, if you had a MMO mouse, it would um, be very useful in this type of game because you can hotkey everything and use your MMO mouse to um, access your items. And so, yeah, the only thing I would say with this being a survival type game, the fact that you get hungry and thirsty so fast, that can be quite annoying because it's less realistic. Not that this has to be realistic, but this is kind of a life sim and she just gets hungry and thirsty entirely too fast. And it could be because we're just feasting on apples and coconut water. So it may be something that she needs a little more substantial foods. Um, like meats, proteins, things like that. So um, that's the only part that I probably would have a big complaint about. Other than that, I really enjoy the game. And when it comes out, I definitely will consider purchasing it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little gameplay. I, I know it was really quick this last bit, but there it is. I wanted to get this out and give you my final thoughts. Um, this is available, will be available on Steam. Um, I hope you were able to try the demo. If not, you know, definitely take a look at it and, you know, look at other people's uh, reviews of this game. And then, of course, if you've come across this particular um, episode, go review, go look at my first episode and you can see me mess around there. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, I will see you next time. I am Pixelated Twix. Ciao.